Hey guys, so review time and um, as you can see from the title, y'all know this is going to be short and it's going to be a rave, okay? So um, it's Curl Junkies um, Daily Hair, smooth, Smoothing Daily Hair Conditioner, okay? First five, water, aloe juice, citral alcohol, BTMS, settle alcohol, and palm oil. Um, it does have, let me see doesn't have anything that people get kind of er about. It has fragrance. Anyways, so it's directed to be a rinse out conditioner, okay? Um, here's what it looks like. Okay. Very creamy. Um, you can kind of feel the oils in it, but it's not so thick. Uh, if you have rehab, it's not as thick as rehab. And it smells awesome. It smells so good i don't know what oh, got on my lap i don't know what smell this is from curl junkie but i really really like this smell okay so um how i use this i've used it as a rinse out and i've used it as a leave-in okay i prefer it as a rinse out all right as a leave-in it's okay but i have stuff that to me will impart more moisture for longer like it's bomb for like day one day one and a half Okay, but when I hit day two, day three, um, especially if I'm trying to stretch like a wash and go or a twist out or something, I would have to re-add it. Okay, get what I'm saying? So as a rinse out, let me tell y'all. So like I said, I, this was in my favorite, so I'm going to repeat a couple things. I heard of, I, I was sleeping on this. I was really sleeping on this and um, Chick on NC uh, posted about it, how she loved it, yada, yada, yada. So I got it. I had an every coupon, so I got it. I rinse this stuff out my hair seriously, hands down, the best, one of the best, if not the best rinse out conditioner I've ever used in my life. I have never, never felt my hair that soft from coat, like, like conditioner washing, okay, co-washing or whatever, um, meaning just using it in the shower putting on my hair for a couple minutes and rinsing it out okay now my hair has felt that soft from a deep conditioner but that's after 15 minutes instant instant softness like <laughs> it's serious like it's so freaking serious this seriously hands down one of I would venture to say top one to two conditioners I've ever used on my hair as a rinse out like this stuff is so freaking bomb and it's like immediate softness immediate slip i mean it's curl junkie so y'all know it's already super slippy i can just did like my little patch these two patches i got a lint in my hair y'all know lint i swear to god my hair attracts so much lint it's ridiculous um what was i saying my kind of tough tough toughness right there the tough tough thing right there yeah this instant instant because I mean I'm not a I've been going away from using tools in my hair so I've been doing a lot of finger detangling and smoothing and separating and crap and this stuff is just I revision to my staple list my holy grail list that I did after you know my one year or whatever this is tops tops rinse out conditioner it's pricey it's very, very pricey. It's like, I want to say 18 to $22, something in that range. Um, but I've used this probably 10 to, 10 to maybe 15 times I've used this. And I still have, what, maybe a third of the bottle left. So it's literally, I don't, my hair is not long. Okay, probably 10 times, maybe not 15, okay. My hair is not long, okay. So I don't use a lot and I you don't need a lot of this, okay? So if you're in the market for an awesome rinse out conditioner, um, hey, I know some people like it as a leave-in, but I have stuff that works better for me as a leave-in. Like if I had to go to Curl Junkie as a leave-in, I would like I I like um Curls Rehab and I like the Argan Oil um conditioner that they have better as a leave-in. But this stuff as a rinse out, y'all. I mean, raising my hands in the shower, catching the spirit, you know, I should like, for real, seriousness 
awesomeness like wow so that's the review short simple sweet curl junkie smoothing daily hair conditioner balm conditioner go get you some <laughs> all right guys so i will talk to y'all later bye